All right, good afternoon. This is Coach Big Pete, a.k.a. Peter Lionelbert, Deep Dish Football Game of the Week, Princeton versus Hall, Week 6. It's going to be an exciting game, no doubt about it. Two 4-1 teams in the Free Rivers, uh, Mississippi Division Conference. Uh, again, to me, and I'm going to say this with both teams, I think the most important key is going to be the pass. Um, I think both teams and defenses are going to be zeroed in on the run. Um, and just let's get to Princeton football first. Now, Princeton, uh, their schedule, pretty pretty interesting schedule. Um, they beat Fulton. It's always a tough game. They beat Newman uh, Central Catholic. I'm sorry, they lost to Newman Central Catholic. That's Newman Central Catholic is always the tough team. Um, they beat St. Bede. Uh, they beat Orion, and they beat Sherrard. Um, and I think the big wins for them were have been Orion and Fulton. I think yeah, and the, the again the tough loss is Newman Central Catholic, but when you play Newman Central Catholic it's it's a toss up in the air. And that that just always that's always a tough team. And uh it's the same loss, I believe, for Hall High School too as well. So again, they got a tough after Hall, they got a pretty easy schedule. I mean, they got a great they got a great chance of uh, and I'll include if they win the Hall game, they've got a great chance of going eight and one. That's no doubt about it for Princeton. Um, players, uh, McClure at the line, Rondé Worrells, He is a world class athlete, uh, running back. He can do it all for Princeton. He is the main guy. Now, my key player is Tyler Gibson at quarterback, and he is going to be a key player for that. Uh, his top connection is of course Wyatt Davis, wide receiver. Um, and I forget, I think he's defensive back, if I'm not mistaken. I And I do apologize if I get the kids' names wrong and position wrong. I do apologize on that one. Um, but it's going to be key that they connect. Or Tyler Gibson, again, like I said, they're going to be squaring in on the run, that whole defense. Pass, pass, pass. Um, and if they can, um, basically take their shots on the field uh, at the right time. And that, that's definitely going to be key for this Princeton offense. But, again, they have a great offensive line, tough, hard-nosed offensive line. Go to the whistle, drive you off the ball, and put you on your ass, basically, offensive line. And Rondé Worlds is a hell of a player, so definitely a kid that you want to keep an eye out for. Um, <clears throat> also, they have uh, two tacklers, uh, two, uh, two uh, linebackers that I believe also play an offensive line. Um, um, sh uh, sh Say hockey, and they got a sophomore. I'm forgetting his name. Drew Harp. He also plays fullback. I'm sorry. He plays fullback and also linebacker. Definitely a kid to keep an eye out for as well. But again, we talk about Princeton when they get into the playoffs. Of course, they're uh, ranked on the AP poll team. They're in a class that is just wide open. They're in a class that's wide open. Um, I think personally, the toughest team there, the toughest team in three right now is Williamsville. Um, there's been there's question marks on all the teams, all the teams. Um, but with Princeton, um, with Worrells, with that good offensive line, offense, what's going to be key, especially when they get into the playoffs, is that pass. They have to have connections, um, and especially if they go against. A more elite defensive line that's going to be tough too but Princeton overall looks they look great and they're going to have a, they're going to give a lot of teams tough times in the playoffs no doubt about it they are going to be a tough team when they get in the playoffs and Princeton with just with those dead amount of athletic talent it's something very positive, uh, especially going into the season with Coach Pearson, going into the offseason with Coach Pearson, I'm sorry, the postseason, the IHSA playoffs, something very positive. So, again, if you like my work, uh, follow Coach Big Pete, Deep Dish Football. Feel free to leave a tip via PayPal, link is on the bottom. Also, Deep Dish Football Live is at 8 p.m. tonight, going to go more into the game, and Saturday too. Um, also... My email is coachpigpetefp at gmail.com if you have any questions. Thank you and have a lovely day.